guys, what's up? It's me, Slimist, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can change your GTA 5 online crew emblem on your phone without a PC. So guys, before we get into the actual tutorial, I just want to say that this method that I'm going to be showing you guys is not free. So it cost, I think the app cost $7. I can't see the exact price because I already uh, own the app, but it's on the app store on iPhone, and I think it costs $7. And if you don't want to spend any money, I did make a tutorial on how to do this that's free. Now, the only reason I'm making this video is because the free tutorial is a little bit inconsistent, or actually really inconsistent, I should say. Um, a lot of times it doesn't work. It doesn't work depending on the phone you actually have. Um, it works way better on older iPhones. So if you do have a better or like a newer iPhone, it's not gonna it's not gonna be very consistent for you. So that's why I'm making this tutorial right here. But like I said, it does cost $7. And I will have the link to the free ones, or the free tutorials linked in the description as well. I will have the PC tutorial linked in the description if you do have a PC and you'd like to do it on there. But anyways, what you're going to want to do first thing is go into the App Store and search up Inspect Browser. Then you're just going to want to go ahead and click on this one right here. Like I said, it costs $7, but for me, I already have it. So I'm just going to go ahead and click open. Uh, and then once you open it, it will take you to just a normal like browser looking thing, except it will have a JavaScript console on the bottom of it. As you can see here, what you're going to want to do is in the search bar, go ahead and search up Rockstar Games Social Club. Then you're just going to want to go ahead and click on the first link right here, Rockstar Games Social Club. And then it will ask you to sign in uh, right here. And it, you should just go ahead and click sign in or you can sign in with your console. And then I will be back after I'm done signing in. Alright guys, so I'm done signing in and it will take you to the screen right here. What you're going to want to do is click on your profile picture in the top right and then click view profile and it should say your username. Then once you're on this screen, go ahead and click on cruise. And then it should show you all the crews that you are currently in. And then what you're going to want to do is click on the crew that you want to change the picture of. So right here, I'm just going to click on the first crew. And then go ahead and click on emblems. And then scroll down and then click the orange button that says create emblem. Now it should pop up this alert. This is completely fine that it pops up with this alert because that's what this app does is it's going to fix it. But anyways, before we go ahead and fix that, what you're gonna to wanna to do is close out of this and then just go back to your home screen and go into normal Safari. And then you're just gonna to wanna to search up GTA 5 emblems. Then what you're going to want to do is go ahead and click on either the first link which is en.gtalogo.org or the second one which is gtalogo.com either of those will work i'm just going to go and click on the first one and this is a whole list and or catalog of emblems you could choose from so we'll be back once i actually find an emblem all right guys so i just found this like stock supreme logo one and what you're going to want to do once you find your emblem you want, you're just going to want to scroll down and then click copy to clipboard right here. And then once it says copied, you're good to go. And then just go ahead and close out of Safari and go back to the other app inspect browser. Now back on inspect browser, you're going to want to click the button in the bottom middle of the screen. Um, and then you're going to want to change the screen size to desktop 1080 
or desktop 1280, whichever one you want. It really doesn't matter, but I'm just doing desktop 1080, and then it will zoom out. You should get this alert. Just go ahead and accept it. It's pretty small. You could zoom in if you want, but uh, just go and accept that, and then you will see this will pop up. What you're going to want to do is click in the bottom left and click console, and then this should pop up on your screen. Go ahead and tap on it and click paste, and it should paste the, uh, like this, okay, I can't talk. It should paste the code that you copied from uh, GTA logos, and then once you paste it, you should see your emblem pop up in the box, and then what you're going to want to do is go ahead and zoom in, in like the bottom left of the screen. And you should see a like smaller version of the emblem you just made. You're going to want to click on it and then click publish. Then go ahead and zoom back out a little bit so you could go and see it. And it's going to pretty much just have this like confirmation that you want to publish this. Make sure you're publishing it to the right clue and then just go ahead and accept it. And then it should say this alert that's saying it's successfully published. And then once you've done that, you're just gonna wanna reset the screen size by once again clicking in the middle, um, the bottom of the screen in the middle, and then changing it back to none so that it'll go back to normal. And then once you've changed it back to normal, you just go ahead and click on your profile picture in the top right again, and then click view profile. And then once you're back on this screen, go ahead and click on cruise again, and then scroll down to the crew that you were trying to change the picture of. And then scroll down and then go back to emblems. And you should see the emblem that you just created pop up. Now, if you see a blank Rockstar logo, that just means it hasn't uploaded all the way yet. So just give it a couple more minutes and then come back. But if it has uploaded like how mine has, you're gonna wanna click the three lines in the bottom and then click make crew emblem then it will pop up this alert and you're just going to want to accept this and pretty much what this is saying is that it'll take up to 30 minutes to show um but it will actually take longer to show in game it could take up to two weeks to show in game so if yours isn't showing up immediately in game that's why just give it two weeks sometimes it takes forever to show up but yeah that's the entire tutorial guys don't forget to like and subscribe if this video helped you and peace Thank <laughs> you.